Chapter 19. Dragon Elephant Prina Power. Sure, Sanchi nodded. With Big Smart around, he could cultivate normally. It was fine as long as he did not die from chi deviation when Big Smart was around. That's good. Big Smart took out an ancient booklet from his pocket. This is the Prina art I cultivate. It's a high-grade Buddhist martial art which requires extreme discipline and yang. If I cultivate it to perfection, it'll achieve Herculean strength. However, it's only the basics for another divine technique. What a meek, dragon elephant prina art. Song Shi was surprised, not only was there an iron sand palm in this world, but there was also the dragon elephant prina art. The advanced cultivation technique, above the prina art, is the dragon elephant art. It's suitable for the Khanate realm. After cultivating it, you will have the power of the dragon elephant. If you manage to cultivate the complete divine technique successfully, you will have the power of the dragon elephant and be on par with an earth immortal. Big Smart introduced, actually, the iron sand palm that Dai Du cultivates is also a part of the true divine sand palm. However, for us, it will probably take us a lifetime to cultivate this basic martial arts. How can we talk about achieving Khanate, even transcendence? Song Shi was stunned. So from what you're saying, cultivating martial arts can also compare to immortal cultivators. Apparently, it's possible in legends. I haven't seen it yet nor am I qualified to verify it. Big Smart smiled bitterly. However, as there are thousands of martial artists, there will always be people who are powerful enough to break through the postnatal limit and cultivate to the Khanate realm. There are also Khanate experts who can transcend the mortal world and are comparable to Earth. Immortals. Song Shi was a little stunned. I thought the cultivators in this world were the best. I heard from Elder Kin that when one cultivates to a high realm, whether it's cultivation or martial arts, they're all the same. It's just that the early stages of martial arts are extremely difficult for us to attain. However, we're not restricted by seemingly unattainable things like spiritual roots. We believe that working hard is more important. Big Smart did not know much about these things either. Elder Kin, it's Khanate expert worshipped by your Song family. There's a Khanate in our family. Song Shi was surprised, he had never come into contact with these things before. Yes, the Song family's wealth in Silken City is enough to rank in the top 10. They are qualified to worship a Khanate expert. At this point, Big Smart said enviously, however, these Khanate experts don't seem to have as much potential as you, young master. Perhaps Khanate experts are one in a million among martial arts practitioners and within them. For people with spiritual roots, their ratio is about 1 in 10,000. However, as long as you cultivate, I believe you can easily match a Kane expert's ability. As for someone like Elder Kin, he has to cultivate for decades to reach this level. Song Shi was deep in thought. For those who practiced martial arts, the various stages were postnatal, Khanate, and transcendent. For cultivators, it was Qi refinement, foundation establishment. This world was more exciting and complicated than he had imagined. Let's not talk about this. Teach me the prana art. Song Chi did not think too far ahead. Even if he practiced martial arts, he would be at the postnatal realm level. He was still far from achieving transcendence. With one more skill, he would have more chances of Qi deviation and, if he managed to cultivate it perfectly, he could even draw a lottery. So why not learn a new skill? All right. Big Smart handed the Prina Technique Manual and the Iron Sand Palm Scroll to Song Shi. The Prina Technique and the Iron Sand Palm Technique condenses genuine Qi differently. The Prina Technique cultivates the Danchen and focuses on refining essence. The Iron Sand Palm focuses on transforming Qi. If I cultivate my Danchen, will it affect my future cultivation? No. The Qi Cultivation Technique is more advanced. It can directly cover the refinement of essence into Qi. This is also one of the reasons why I didn't refuse to teach you the Prina art. After confirming that you really have an immortal root, Big Smart shook his head. However, the Prina art is different from the Iron Sand Palm's Qi circulation technique. If Young Master cultivates it at the same time, you have to be careful. Don't cultivate it until the point of breathlessness. Understood. Sanchi began to listen to Big Smart explain the basics of cultivation to him. He understood all the meridians, acupuncture points and bone structures in his body. His powerful comprehension allowed him to easily grasp the concepts. Then, 
He directly entered the cultivation stage of his internal strength cultivation method. With Big Smart's guidance, Song Shi had enough experience to cultivate the Iron Sand Palm internal strength cultivation method. With regards to the Prina, our cultivation, he had successfully mastered it without encountering any problems. All the essence Qi in his body had condensed in his danshan, causing his abdomen to feel as though it was burning. Big Smart felt sour when he saw that San Shi had achieved what he needed 10 days to achieve in less than half a day. So this is the ability of an immortal seedling. There's really no way to compare. At this moment, San Shi opened his eyes and let out a breath of hot air. Let's go to the new moon brothel. He had only slowly cultivated for a few cycles, but he still felt that his entire body was burning with desire. He couldn't take it anymore. Look, I said this isn't suitable for you, young master. Big Smart was speechless. To cultivate this Buddhist martial art, you have to abstain from lust and achieve the six peaceful roots. I'm not a Buddhist disciple. There's no need to be so particular. Forget it. I forgot that you said you're not suitable to go to the new moon brothel. I'll go myself. Song Shi stood up. As for my safety, don't worry. Although my combat experience is not as good as yours, I still have some brute force. Ordinary people can't bully me. Thank you for your understanding, young master. Old Liu, I fought with the monsters that were poisoned today and gained some achievements. I really want to cultivate in seclusion. Big Smart said politely. Have fun. Young master. Yad, Sanchi could not wait to leave. This time, he had cultivated the Prina art to the basics and had spent a lot of time doing so. It was already sunset when he secretly left through the side door. When the carriage arrived at New Moon Brothel, the moon was already high in the sky. Sanchi entered and said, I'm looking for Zur. Mei Niang's eyes flashed with surprise. She did not expect this kid to be so energetic in less than a day. Young people were indeed energetic. They could recover so quickly after being squeezed dry by that greedy girl, Zur. She walked over and smiled. Young master, please wait in the Crescent Moon private room. I'll go and ask. Bring me some food and wine first. Song Shi was hungry. He ordered the maids to fill his stomach again. Yo, old song, your dead dogs came back to life and you still have the mood to come here to look for Zur. A fat young man with greasy hair appeared from upstairs and looked at Song Shi mockingly. Tonight, Miss Zur belongs to me, Sun Juan. This person was the illegitimate son of the Sun family, a large family of officials in Silken City. Similar to him, he liked to visit brothels, but his taste was very specific. He enjoyed causing harm to innocent and good women. As such, Song Shi did not like to associate with him. Coupled with the fact that they would fight for girls' attention from time to time, their relationship was quite strained. Ever since Zur came here, she has been accompanying me. Why do you like to steal other people's things so much? Song Shi was disdainful. This guy especially liked to cause harm to married women. And had caused many families to break apart from his actions. He looked down on him from the bottom of his heart. The girls here belong to whoever is rich. So what if she keeps accompanying you? Don't you know that I let her serve you on purpose? To let her have some experience first, so that she can serve me comfortably. Ha ha. Sun Juan laughed proudly, causing many people to laugh lewdly along with him. Song Shi frowned in displeasure. All men were possessive, although he did not have a good impression of Zur after knowing that she had deliberately sucked his yawn energy dry, this guy's words still made him uncomfortable. Old Song, get lost if you know what's good for you. Go back and deal with your dogs. Ha ha, read Lattice chapters at Wuxiu World, sight only. Sun Juan laughed arrogantly. He saw that Song Shi did not bring any guards today. Even if he bullied him, what could Song Shi do? Song Shi rubbed his palms. A gentleman uses his mouth but not his fists. However, Song Shi did not consider himself a gentleman and strode upstairs. Why? Are you angry from embarrassment and want to fight? When Sun Juan saw Song Shi walking over, he sneered. You're alone. Do you even dare to come and hit me?